Assalamualaikum and hello everyone. My name is Lily Nur Umaira Sumaya binti Busa and my name is Nur Shara binti Ahmad. We are Super AI team from SK Indra Sabah Tawau Sabah or known as Kids. The title of our game is Save the Sea. So friends, I would like to ask you, do you know what water pollution is? If you don't, don't worry, you are in the right track because we are thrilled to talk about water pollution and how to reduce them. Hmm, but first, Shahira, what is water pollution? Water pollution is the contamination of water bodies with a negative impact on their uses. It is usually a result of human activities. Water bodies include lakes, river, ocean, and groundwater. Get polluted by throwing rubbish into the water or by dumping toxic waste into the water. Actually, we have a behind story of our game. When one day Shahira and I were walking around our village, when suddenly we heard about the elders talking about water pollution on our village. So that when we thought, let's make a fun game to teach people about water pollution. Ew, the beach is so dirty. Yeah, it was. Mm, I hope someone will clean the beach, Patricia. Me too, Alicia. Shahira, did you hear that? Um, how about we make a game about water pollution? Let's go! So today, I will give you a simple situation of water pollution. Imagine on very fine day, you feel very thirsty and I give you a two bottles. But you only choose one only. The first bottle is nice, clean and clear. And the second bottle is filled with dirt water. Yuck! Which one you will choose? Aha! I bet you definitely pick the clean one, right? Because we all know it's tough to drink. Now, let us show you on how our game works. In level 1, your goal is to catch 15 rubbish. In level 2, you have to catch the rubbish without touching the puffer fish. The puffer fish can be symbolized as a bomb. Be careful. In level 3, it gets trickier. You have to catch the rubbish, but this time you have to avoid to pop a fish while cleaning it up. If you win, the green lights went on like a twinkle star. But if you lose, red lights are coming for you. We have used M block to make the cording and Ordinal Uno as the control board. To connect with our prototype, the genre of our game is casual. We make this game about one month and the prototype is two weeks. Did you know? What are the materials or the tools that we use to make our project? If you don't, come and follow me. To build the prototype, we are using polystyrene, palaka pen, and colored paper. And for the control board, we are using Mecha Uno or Arduino Uno, breadboard, 4 times quick wiring terminal, 11 pieces LED, 11 pieces resistor, and wire. Actually, we joined this Junior Innovate competition to know more about how to make a game and as well educate people on how important to taking care of our environment. Killing to but with stone, don't we? Before we end our video, we would like to ask you, are you a natural lover? Because we could fight for a population for a lover like you. We hope when we make this game, we will be inspiring people out there to reduce water pollution and save all animals on the water. Save the sea! That's all from us. Thank you.